Hello everyone, welcome to Byte Geek. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install APK files on a Windows 11 system. If you've ever wanted to run Android apps on your computer, this tutorial will guide you through every step. To get started, we need to enable support for Android apps on Windows 11. This is done by installing the Windows subsystem for Android, commonly referred to as WSA. Before we proceed, let's make sure your system meets the minimum requirements. Your computer should have at least 6 to 8 gigabytes of RAM. An SSD drive is recommended for optimal performance. You'll need a modern processor, such as an Intel Core i5 6th or 8th generation or newer. Lastly, ensure that virtualization is enabled on your system through the BIOS or UEFI firmware. To check if virtualization is enabled on your computer, Follow these steps. Open the Task Manager, right-click on Taskbar and select Task Manager. Navigate to the Performance tab. Look for Virtualization on the right-hand side. If it says Enabled, you're good to go. If not, you'll need to enable it in your system's BIOS or UEFI. Once virtualization is confirmed, the next step is to enable the Virtual Machine Platform feature in Windows. Here's how. Search for Windows Features in the Start menu and click on Turn Windows Features On or Off. In the pop-up window, look for Virtual Machine Platform, check the box next to it and click OK. Restart your computer to apply these changes. After completing these steps, your system is now ready to install Windows Subsystem for Android. To download Windows Subsystem for Android for Windows 11, open the browser and type Windows Subsystem for Android. Open the GitHub link. I have also provided this link in the video description below. Scroll down the page and find the latest stable build for Windows. You can download the latest stable build for Windows system. If you are using Windows 11, then download for Windows 11, or if you are using Windows 10, then download for Windows 10. We are using Windows 11, so we will download Windows 11 x64 for 64-bit operating system. Scroll down the page and find the latest stable build for Windows 11. Click the second link in the list to download the WSA package. This particular build includes the Google Play Store, which will allow you to install Android apps just like you would on any Android device. Once the download is complete, now extract the zip file using tools like 7-Zip or WinRAR application. Open the extracted folder and double click on the run.bat file. The installation process will start. And once it's complete, both WSA and the Play Store will be installed on your computer. If you want to install Android apps directly from the Play Store, open the Play Store app and sign in with your Google account. Now we have successfully logged in into our Google account. Now we can download any app we want from Android App Store. We have installed the application. However, this video focuses on sideloading APK files, so let's move on to that. APK sideloading means manually installing Android app packages, APKs, onto a device, bypassing official app stores like Google Play. Open Windows Subsystem for Android app. Navigate to Advanced Settings. Enable Developer Mode and click on Manage Developer Settings. Scroll down and find USB debugging. Toggle on USB debugging to allow your system to install APKs. Next, download the WSA Pacman tool.
Download the WSA Pac-Man tool from its GitHub page, link provided in the description. Scroll down and click on WSA Pac-Man latest release. Scroll down and download installer executable file for Windows. After its download, run the file and install the tool on your computer. After installation finish, launch the tool. Allow ADB debugging if asked. If everything is set up correctly, you'll see a connected in the tool. Now that everything is ready, you can install APK files on your Windows computer. You can download the APK files from APK Pure website. You can find this website link my YouTube description. Locate the APK file you want to download. After downloading the file, simply run the APK file. Click install to installed using the WSA Pac-Man tool, just like installing a regular EXE file on Windows. After installation, you can search the application like we normally do in Windows. Go to Start Menu and type the application name in search bar and press Enter. You can create a desktop shortcut for the app if needed. And that's it. Installing APK files on a Windows computer is incredibly easy with the Windows subsystem for Android and the WSA Pac-Man tool. Whether it's games, productivity apps or anything else, you can now enjoy the convenience of running them directly on your PC. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe for more tech tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.